Hello again, everyone. Todd Strooch, the horror nerd here at the Horror Sideshow Market in Allentown, Pennsylvania, brought to you by New Jersey Horror Con and Film Festival. I am sitting here with horror icon, star of Return of the Living Dead, Tommy Jarvis from Friday the 13th himself, Mr. Tom Matthews. Tom, how are you? I'm well, thank you. Thanks for having me. Thanks for hosting this. It's uh, <laughs> great to be out here in Allentown, Pennsylvania. So far, we've had some great weather. How has the day been for you? I see you have had a long line we've here been, all day. Uh, yeah, we've been lucky. It's a great, been a great turnout. The fans are really gracious and, and great, and uh, uh, everything's going, going great. Thank you. Fantastic. So, Tom, I'm curious, does it ever, you know, a lot of the movies that we all, horror fans, we all know and love have been around for a while. Does it ever surprise you that after all this time, people still come and line up, you know, to meet you and, and talk about their favorite movies? Yeah, it's, it's you? pretty amazing. The horror fans are amazing. Uh, the best fans in the world. And they've supported these great movies and these great franchises for a very very long time as they should and then we, you know we got the game the uh, Friday the 13th the game out now so it's we got a, a lot of young kids uh, who probably shouldn't see the movie just yet but <laughs> are able to play the game so they're creating a whole new fan base which is which is fantastic I we're doing all, that. And, and all the fan films now for Friday all the Friday movies and, and things like that so it's been a lot of fun it is amazing. I mean, when you, obviously, when you were in the movies, did you have any idea about kind of the life that it would take on and just how big this Absolutely was? Absolutely not. I had no idea. I was just happy to have a job at, you know, being in my early 20s and just starting out as a, as a young actor and, and things like that. But I had no idea that, you know, Return of the Living Dead became part of pop culture now because whenever... Anyone thinks of zombies eating brains, they know that, but they necessarily haven't seen the movie. So uh, it's pretty. It's been an incredible ride, and you know all the cast members from both Return and Friday the Thirteenth franchises have been really great, and we're all like a big family. And these events uh, are able to bring us all back together, so it's been fun hanging out with uh, the cast, especially CJ and and. and uh, Miguel and, and the whole gang, Tom McLaughlin, of course, who created, directed, and, 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 and wrote, and, and, and just a really good guy and a good friend. That's awesome. One thing I'm always, myself, I'm surprised to hear is that a lot of people that are known for being in horror movies, such as yourself, are not actually fans of horror movies. How about you? That's true. I, fan? I never was. What I, what I appreciated was uh, uh, the filmmaking aspect of it. Well, if you think about what Tom had to do, he had to, Tom McLaughlin, the director, writer, he had to create uh, a certain number of kills, and Jason was in it, and and within all of that, he was able to form and, and write a, a really heartwarming uh, story. So there was a little bit of a love story in there, and I uh, had the father, the sheriff, and, and Vinny Gustafero as the deputy, which was fantastic. So the way he shot it all, too, it was beautiful. So I think that's what kind of responded to the fans is uh, the humanistic side of, uh, uh, of, the, of uh, part six. Yeah, I, I agree with that. I mean, I, that's, I'm a child of the 80s and, you know, 80s horror, late 70s, you know, into the 80s. So I literally grew up with these films you know so the fact that now I get to go to fan conventions and the fact that I get to do this is, is always a real thrill for me just as a fan yeah thank you genre. thanks <laughs> so Pleasure. um lastly Tom what are you uh, what are you working on these days any new projects uh, you're involved with? we're What's doing we're gonna do the fan film uh, never hike again hopefully in September depending on what's going on with the pandemic and uh, I'm just talking to these people about that movie that they uh, go away so we're in negotiations okay. today it's a horror film and did a movie called uh, killer therapy which is out there now uh, pretty gruesome uh, kind of a sad story but I play a father of a mentally challenged uh, son and it just uh, creates all kinds of havoc and, and things like that so it's a, a good thing to watch and uh, just doing the conventions you know making the convention circuit now that uh, there's been some restrictions that have been lifted, so it's been fun getting out. 
going all over the country doing doing that this, these kind of events so it's been fun yeah I mean it is good to just be out of the house I gotta be honest with you it's like I said it's a beautiful day today I mean, the turnout is good everybody's having a good time so it is good to be back in the swing My pleasure. Of Tom thank you so Boom. much for a few minutes of your time sure. I truly appreciate it I wish you best of luck in all your future thank you. endeavors thank and you very thank much you so I appreciate much. that Tom Matthews everybody the horror nerd here at the horror side show flea market in Allentown brought to you by New Jersey Horror Con. We will see all of you in the next interview.